Come on, I know Kwon ain't going out like one of them let me perform ass niggas, man. And a hookah lounge? Nobody in Savannah should be listening to dirt, bro. Gang, gang, what it do? Welcome back to another video, back to another reaction. If you're new to the channel, go ahead and do me a huge favor, man. Go ahead and like the video, subscribe to the channel. Ring the bell, then ring the bell here, oh man. And um, throughout the video, man, y'all can drop y'all comments down below, man. I want to know you guys' opinion. You feel me? Like, I like to basically have a debate with the supporters, so just do that. But if you're going to comment, man, do me a solid and subscribe. You feel me? On the road to 600 subscribers, man. Y'all know how we do it over here, man. For every 100 subscribers I get, I'm going to give away some money on cash. Yo. But before we get into it, I need you guys to know I got a couple's channel with my beautiful wife. It's called Down in Corner. The link is in the description below. Also, follow me on Instagram at KingDon. I'm Scope South for you. Feel me? Now, let's get into what we're going to get into, folks. We got that boy, Quando Rondo. You dig? Now, I thought Quando was done. I ain't going to even count with y'all, man. And, and I'm from Georgia. South Georgia, too. I'm about two hours away from Savannah, bro. Maybe three. So, to see somebody from Savannah, Georgia doing their thing, bro, it, it meant a lot to me. And plus, I like to go on River Street, go to Wet Willie, man. For some reason, man, I had gave up on Kwondo. I feel like Kwondo had done fell off. The whole King Von thing did more harm than help for him. And it made me see how hip hop could really turn their back on you and how they really rock with who they want to rock with. Because if y'all don't remember, bro, after Von passed, Meek Mill said, it's time to pick a side. And I think Quando Rondo was banking on his fan base being like NBA Youngboy's fan base. Because NBA Youngboy run the internet. He ain't got to make a song with nobody. He run YouTube, internet, all that. But I don't think Quando has that same faith. You did? So anyway, I'm on the internet scrolling, right? And I come across this right here, gang. I'm going to show this to y'all. It says, Quando Rondo is currently trending for shouting out Lil Dirt at his show at a local hookah lounge. Now, gang, there's a couple of things wrong with this right here, bro. A couple of things, bro. First of all, bro, Quando Rondo at a hookah lounge? You know what I'm saying? Like, the, the damn shouting out Lil Dirt, but Quando at a hookah lounge? I couldn't believe it, bro. A video came with it, folks. So we just gonna pull the video right up. And just and just look at this for ourselves, you did. That's him. That's him, bro. I can tell. I can tell by this right here. Look at this right here. Look, look. There you go. That Kwando. That's Kwando. And don't get me wrong, I'm not saying there's something wrong with performing a hookah lounge. But then it says a local hookah lounge. So I'm thinking like, that nigga in Savannah on top of a bar performing what? Like, well, he just walked in there to get some chicken wings or something. They were like, oh, don't run on the spot. And then he was like, oh, man, I did it. I be balling. And he was like playing his song. So he was like, man, hey, let me perform. <laughs> Come on, I know Kwando ain't going out like one of them let me perform ass niggas, man. Come on, man. <laughs> That he had a hookah lounge, bro. I just can't get over that, bro. I just can't. And then on the song, maybe maybe this is an old record, bro. But I don't know. I would have had the DJ basically stop the music and I would have said Cheerios or, or something like it, it. It's a lot of stuff he could have said other than Dirty Yo. He could have said, uh, uh, put holes in you like Cheerios, you know what I'm saying? Uh, you know what I'm saying? Uh, uh, I don't know, uh, but he fruity though, you know what I'm saying? Like, he ain't have to say dirty, yo, so the fact he shot not dirt, he know what they going through. You know dirt won't blood, bro. Dirt is not gonna be your friend, gang. And, and like I said, I'm not saying that he made that song recently. That's probably an old song. But the DJ should have cut it. Nobody in Savannah should be listening to dirt, bro. I'm, I'm a Smurf fan, I'm a Von fan, bro, but hey, dog. You know it came too far to be... You know what I'm saying? In Savannah on River Street at Hookah Lounges performing, bro. And then the DJ play that song when you shout out dirt. Stop playing, bro. 
Stop playing, man. Quando, you came too far, bro. You don't came too far, bro. Get back on your grind. Get back to the music. You know what I'm saying? And uh, get back to doing what you do, man. You know what I'm saying? Get back to double G's. I be in and now I'm ballin'. Double cup. Now I'm ballin'. You know what I'm saying? That's what we need because your boy Lil Tim tried. He, he ain't got it. He ain't got it, Quando. You got it. You the one. Cause so just get back to it. Stay the hell out of these hookah lounges and don't be jumping on top of bars, performing and shit, man. You that guy in Savannah. There's nothing wrong with being humble, but find another way to be humble. Ride through the hood or some shit. I don't know. I don't know, gang. But yeah. Y'all drop y'all comments down below. What y'all think, man? You know what I'm saying? What y'all think? Yeah, I want to know what y'all think about this whole situation, man. You feel me? So. Yo, I go by done, man. I love y'all. Y'all don't forget, coming like, subscribe to the channel, ring the bell, ring the bell, hit all, join the gang, join the family, join the mob, man. I love y'all. Let's get it.